philosophies revived. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to dive into a topic that might just change the way you see your life. Why life should not be perfect. I know, I know, it sounds a bit strange, right? We're all taught to aim for perfection, to strive to be the best at everything we do. But what if I told you that embracing imperfection can actually lead to a more fulfilling, exciting, and ultimately happier life? Stick with me here, because by the end of this video, you might just have a whole new perspective on those little imperfections that we all have. So, let's get started. Have you ever felt that pressure to be perfect? Whether it's at work, in your relationships, or even in your hobbies, there's this constant push to be flawless. And let's be honest, it's exhausting. We spend so much time and energy trying to live up to these unrealistic standards that we often forget to appreciate the journey we're on. Today, we're going to break down why that perfect life isn't just unattainable, but why it's also not even something we should be aiming for in the first place. We'll start with a story that perfectly illustrates the pitfalls of trying to live a flawless life. Then, we'll dive into the beauty of imperfection and how it can actually enhance your life in ways you might not have considered. We'll talk about the importance of the present moment and how focusing on now can help you shape a better future. I'll share some personal anecdotes and practical tips on how to embrace imperfection and we'll even touch on some scientific insights into why letting go of the quest for perfection can lead to greater happiness. By the end of this video, I hope you'll see that life's imperfections are not just okay. There's something to be celebrated. They make us who we are, and they add depth and richness to our experiences. So, sit back, relax, and let's explore why life should not be perfect. Let me ask you something. Do you think your life is perfect? Are you truly satisfied and happy with where you are and what you have? I bet most of us would say no, right? But have you ever stopped to wonder why that is? We're constantly bombarded with images and stories of perfect lives. Whether it's on social media, in movies, or even in the lives of people around us, it seems like everyone else has it all figured out. But here's the thing, perfection is an illusion. No one's life is truly perfect, and that's actually a good thing. Think about it. If everyone's life were perfect, there would be no room for growth, no challenges to overcome, and no stories to tell. Our imperfections are what make us unique. They shape our experiences and give us character. Imagine reading a book where the protagonist never faces any challenges or struggles. It would be pretty boring, right? It's the ups and downs, the twists and turns, that make a story interesting. The same goes for our lives. The myth of perfection. We live in a world obsessed with perfection. From the flawless Instagram feeds to the success stories splashed across media. It seems like everyone else is living the perfect life. But here's a little secret perfection is a myth. No one's life is perfect, and honestly, it shouldn't be. Let's unpack this a bit. Perfection, as we often perceive it, is an unattainable standard. It's this elusive goal that we chase, but never quite reach. And the pursuit of perfection can be incredibly stressful and demoralizing. When we constantly strive to be perfect, we set ourselves up for disappointment. We become our own harshest critics, focusing on our flaws and shortcomings instead of celebrating our achievements and progress. Think about social media for a moment. We see curated images and posts that highlight the best moments of people's lives. But what we don't see are the struggles, the setbacks, and the everyday imperfections that everyone experiences. Social media creates a distorted reality, making us believe that perfection is not only possible but also the norm. This can lead to feelings of inadequacy and low self-esteem as we compare our real lives to the highlight reels of others. A story of the perfect man. Let me tell you a story about a man who thought he had life all figured out. He meticulously planned every aspect of his life, aiming for perfection. He calculated his lifespan, 
spent his earnings lavishly, and retired exactly when he planned to. But guess what? When he reached his 90-year year, expecting a grand finale, life threw him a curveball. His perfect plan crumbled because life doesn't adhere to our expectations. It's like trying to catch the horizon. Every time you think you've reached it, it moves further away. This man's story is a perfect illustration of the futility of trying to control every aspect of our lives. Despite his best efforts, he couldn't account for the unpredictability of life. He spent his whole life chasing perfection, only to be left disappointed when things didn't go according to plan. It's a powerful reminder that no matter how much we plan and prepare, life has a way of surprising us. The idea of perfection can often lead us to a false sense of security. We believe that if we can just get everything right, then we'll be happy and content. But life doesn't work that way. It's full of twists and turns, and our plans often get disrupted by unforeseen events. This is where the beauty of imperfection comes in. It forces us to be flexible, adaptable, and resilient. It teaches us to roll with the punches and make the best of whatever comes our way. The beauty of imperfection. Life is like a river, constantly flowing and changing. If it were perfect, it would be stagnant, and nothing stagnant ever grows. Evolution, the fundamental theory of life, is all about change and improvement. Imperfection means there's always room for growth, new horizons to discover, and new challenges to conquer. The beauty of imperfection lies in its dynamic nature. Imagine if everything in life were perfect and unchanging. It would be like watching the same movie on repeat eventually. It would get boring. Imperfections bring variety and excitement to our lives. They keep us on our toes and push us to adapt and grow. Each challenge we face, each mistake we make, is an opportunity to learn and become better. Consider the process of learning a new skill. When you start, you're bound to make mistakes. You might stumble, get frustrated, or feel like giving up. But as you keep practicing, you improve. Those initial mistakes and imperfections are crucial steps in your journey towards mastery. They teach you what doesn't work, so you can discover what does. The present moment, our life is limited by time, space, and circumstances. We can't change our past, but we can shape our future by focusing on the present. Imagine life as a canvas, and every moment is a brushstroke. Sometimes, the strokes are smooth and beautiful. Other times, they're messy and chaotic. But together, they create a masterpiece that's uniquely yours. Focusing on the present moment is crucial, because it's the only time we truly have control over. The past is gone, and the future is uncertain. By living in the present, we can make conscious choices that shape our future. It's about being mindful and fully engaged in what we're doing right now. Consider how often we get caught up in regrets about the past or worries about the future. These thoughts can be overwhelming and prevent us from enjoying the present. We might miss out on simple pleasures or important opportunities because we're too distracted by what was or what might be. By practicing mindfulness and staying grounded in the present, we can reduce stress and find more joy in our daily lives. Setting smart goals to make the most of our imperfect lives, we need to set smart goals specific, measurable, achievable, realistic, and time-bound. Think about it. If you're aiming to complete your master's degree with distinction, you'll plan your actions from day one. You'll choose a university, consider the amenities, and set a timeline. It's not about perfection, it's about purposeful progress. Setting smart goals helps us focus our efforts and stay on track. When our goals are specific, we have a clear direction to follow. Instead of saying, I want to get fit, we can set a specific goal like, I want to run a 5K race in three months. This gives us a concrete target to aim for and helps us break down our goal into manageable steps. Measurable goals allow us to track our progress and stay motivated. By having a way to measure our success, we can see how far we've come and what we still need to do. 
For example, if your goal is to save money, you can set a measurable goal like, I want to save $5,000 by the end of the year. You can then track your savings each month and adjust your actions accordingly. Embracing challenges. Life's challenges are like spices in a dish. They add flavor and depth. Imagine eating the same bland meal every day. Boring, right? Similarly, a life without challenges would be dull. The ups and downs, joys and sorrows, victories and defeats, they all make life interesting and worth living. Challenges push us out of our comfort zones and help us grow. When we face obstacles, we learn more about ourselves and our capabilities. Each challenge we overcome builds our resilience and confidence. It's like going to the gym. The more we lift, the stronger we become. Challenges are the weights that build our mental and emotional muscles. Consider a time when you faced a significant challenge. It might have been a difficult project at work, a personal loss, or a major life change. In the moment, it probably felt overwhelming and stressful. But looking back, you likely gained valuable insights and skills from that experience. Challenges teach us important lessons and help us develop new strengths. Learning from a child. Ever watched a toddler learning to walk? They fall over and over again, but never give up. They don't follow a manual or imitate others. They rely on their instincts. As we grow, we should embrace that same spirit of resilience and curiosity. There's no ready-made role model for any of us. We're all unique, and that's what makes life beautiful. Children have an incredible capacity for resilience and perseverance. When a toddler is learning to walk, they don't get discouraged by their falls. Instead, they get back up and try again, driven by an innate curiosity and determination. This process of trial and error is how they learn and grow. As adults, we can learn a lot from this approach. One of the key lessons we can learn from children is the importance of a growth mindset. A growth mindset is the belief that abilities and intelligence can be developed through dedication and hard work. Children naturally exhibit this mindset. They don't see failure as a reflection of their abilities, but as a part of the learning process. Adopting a growth mindset can help us embrace challenges and persist in the face of setbacks. Competing with yourself. In the race of life, your biggest competitor should be yourself. Don't waste time comparing yourself to others. It's like comparing apples to oranges pointless. Focus on your own growth, your own journey. Strive to be better than you were yesterday. Comparison is often called the thief of joy and for good reason. When we constantly compare ourselves to others, we set ourselves up for feelings of inadequacy and self-doubt. It's easy to look at someone else's achievements and feel like we're falling short but the truth is, everyone's journey is unique. We all have different strengths, challenges, and timelines. Instead of comparing ourselves to others, we should focus on our own progress. Competing with yourself means setting personal goals and striving to improve on your past performance. It's about being the best version of yourself, not a copy of someone else. This approach is much more fulfilling and empowering living authentically to live a fulfilling life you need to be true to yourself don't try to imitate others it's like wearing someone else's shoes uncomfortable and unnatural embrace your quirks your flaws and your unique talents they're what make you you living authentically means being honest with yourself about who you are and what you want out of life it's about aligning your actions and decisions with your values and beliefs. This might sound simple, but in a world full of external pressures and expectations, it can be challenging to stay true to yourself. One of the first steps to living authentically is self-awareness. Take time to reflect on your values, passions, and goals. What makes you happy? What are you passionate about? What are your strengths and weaknesses? Understanding these aspects of yourself can help you make decisions that align with your true self. The power of imperfection. Imperfection drives us to try harder, to strive for better, 
and to challenge the status quo. It's what makes life dynamic and ever-evolving. Think of life as a dance. If every step were predictable, it would be boring. The missteps, the spontaneous twirls, that's where the magic happens. Embracing imperfection means recognizing that life is a journey, not a destination. It's about understanding that mistakes and failures are not only inevitable, but also valuable. They teach us lessons and help us grow. When we stop fearing imperfection and start seeing it as an opportunity, we unlock our potential. Imperfection encourages us to take risks. If we're too focused on being perfect, we might avoid stepping out of our comfort zones. But it's through taking risks that we discover new opportunities and experiences. Imagine an artist who never experiments with new techniques for fear of making a mistake. Their work would remain stagnant. By embracing imperfection, we open ourselves up to creativity and innovation. Creating your own path there's a saying, those who follow others' footsteps leave no imprint of their own. Create your own path, make your own rules. Life is an adventure, and you are the hero of your own story. Embrace the imperfections and let them guide you to new discoveries. Creating your own path means living life on your own terms. It's about listening to your inner voice and following your passions, even if it means going against the grain. This can be challenging, especially when societal expectations and external pressures try to dictate your choices, but it's essential for leading a fulfilling and authentic life. One of the first steps to creating your own path is self-discovery. Take time to explore your interests, values, and goals. What excites you? What do you believe in? What kind of life do you want to live? Answering these questions can help you chart a course that aligns with your true self. It's also important to embrace your unique talents and strengths. We all have something special to offer the world. Instead of trying to fit into a predefined mold, celebrate what makes you different. Your unique perspective and skills can lead to innovative ideas and solutions. So next time you face a challenge or stumble along your path, smile and remember it's all part of the beautiful, imperfect journey we call life. Embrace your uniqueness, celebrate your progress, and find joy in the present moment. Life is not a destination, it's a journey, and it's the imperfections that make it truly remarkable. Thank you for joining me today. If this video resonated with you, please share it with your friends and family. Let's spread the message that imperfection is not only okay, but something to be celebrated. Together, we can create a community that values authenticity and supports each other's growth. Until next time, embrace your imperfections and live your life to the fullest.